many women are there here today, oh, in all? There must be at least 25, 30 of us here today. There's a lot of blue heads <laughs> going around here today. There are. And you guys call it, when you get together to do this, do you call it a... Pierogi bee. Okay. <laughs> they call it a pierogi bee, which is great, except they totally stole my rap name. <laughs> My name's Pierogi B, and I'm here to say I roll potato in dough in a funky, fresh way. <laughs> I know pierogies play a large part of, of fundraising. Just for an example, in 2006, we had a huge, huge homecoming, a week-long celebration here in Gilbert Plains, and everybody in the community got together, and we made 1,300 dozen pierogies to help cover funds to have put on our homecomings. 1,300 dozen? In fact, that's a suspicious amount of pierogies. I know what you keep telling me about hemp, but frankly, that sounds like the munchies to me. <laughs> Who's buying all these pierogies? Oh, we have some elderly people at a Dauphin that are phoning and saying, hey, we would, we'll buy five dozen or ten dozen or whatever, and... It's amazing what pierogies have done for this town. It's really remarkable, you know? Repairs to the community hall, pierogies did that. Supplies for the homecoming celebrations, that's pierogi money. Pierogies will buy you a new pair of pants and make you unbutton them. <laughs> There's a lot of different steps to making pierogies. Like that? Am I pushing too hard, maybe? Yeah. yeah. It's a delicate touch. I just, sometimes I can't control my own strength. I can see that. You roll it out and you cut out the circles, which apparently is best done with an empty Campbell soup can. <laughs> How's that? Perfect. And then you've got a very important step, the pinching and the stuffing. Grab one of those balls, and you grab a circle. Yeah, it looks like these are not gonna fit in there. <laughs> but I thought, oh, geez, story of my life. When it comes to pinching, I'm all cocky and confident. When it comes to actually stuffing, I'm a disappointment. I know it. I know I am. Don't fall apart on me in there, <laughs> Pierogi. It would be very embarrassing. Okay. When it goes in the pot, if you've done it right, the idea is it won't come apart. While I was stirring, a couple <laughs> did come apart. It's okay, Johnny, if they break. It occurred to me, this is a metaphor for what it means to, to fundraise for this community. Basically, if you don't make ends meet, things will fall apart. <laughs>